Summer weather sticking around here in Western Mass, but one local farm is getting ready to celebrate fall and, believe it or not, <laughs> Christmas. Let's see, how many days left? A while. <laughs> yeah. Western Mass News reporter Alyssa McCann shows us how a local holiday tradition is living on. The warm summer temps are still very much present in Western Mass. But some people are getting ready for fall, while others are already looking ahead to Christmas. I do get lots of phone calls the past month or so. I've been busy answering the phone and people really excited about asking me the question about when we're opening. The long-standing Christmas tree tagging tradition will begin again on September 12th at Paul Bunyan's farm in Chicopee. People are going to be excited about coming in here and picking out, getting their ribbons and getting their name tag and walking out to the fields. It might seem a little early to be thinking about Christmas, but the special tradition here is something families look forward to. I especially feel confident that we are going to have a really great season ahead of us. Susan Lopes, the owner and farmer at Paul Bunyan's, says while everyone was hunkered down and quarantined, she was out in the field perfecting her trees. I've worked really hard to make sure that they look as beautiful as they do because they do. T they are a lot of work. And Lopes tells Western Mass News, although there were severe drought conditions throughout Western Mass, the trees are staying strong. I'm just always. I'm amazed by their resiliency and the fact that they can survive drought conditions, go weeks on end without a drop of water, and they're still beautiful. And although our economy continues to struggle, Lopes is hopeful her business will flourish and families will remain joyous this holiday season. We like to talk about back in 2008 when the stock market crashed and the economy took a really bad turn. Christmas tree sales did not suffer. Uh, matter of fact, we've seen sales increase every year since then. We're pretty positive there will be a continued sense of tradition around here this year, despite the fact that there is a, a pandemic. For Western Mass News, I'm Alyssa McCann.